Hey, welcome to a new video. Now, there's a lot of people in the world who believe in ghosts and paranormal events. However, if you're someone who doesn't believe in them, then this video will definitely make you think. Before we get started, I just wanted to let you know that you should click away if you're not into scary videos. So, you've been warned. Are you new to this channel? Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And before we start, also like the video. Tony Ferguson is a personal trainer, who along with his friend Paul Kissel goes looking for all kinds of different paranormal places around the world. In 2018, they plan to investigate Hearst Castle in Hampshire, England. The castle dates back to the 16th century, when it was a military base. The place is said to have a dark past, and when the two went to investigate the castle, they quickly got the feeling that some kind of strange energy was in the air. In fact, this was not the first time they experienced strange things in the castle. They decided at one point to put a camera on several rooms, and when they returned the next day, they were shocked. In one of the rooms, there was a small window, and what they saw gave them chills all over their body. Now, of course, this could be a person, but the other side of the window would have been bricked up a long time ago, so no one could get in. So who or what was this? In the following video, some students were shooting footage of an old psychiatric hospital in California. They were working on a school assignment when they came across something unexpected. When they set the camera down, at one point a ghost came into view. According to the story, this psychiatric hospital had been empty for a long time. The students would have also heard footsteps and other unexplained noises. Even old employees who worked at the hospital report seeing ghosts. However, some people in the comments are skeptical. But the person who uploaded the video himself claims that the video footage was not edited. In the following livestream, three friends are playing a game when suddenly something creepy happens. They were talking to each other when one of them noticed something in the background. Watch what happened near the mannequin. As you can see, a suitcase moved from nowhere, as if there was an invisible force inside the mannequin. The man questions if others saw this too, and to their surprise, one of them even heard a sound. Unfortunately, not much more is known about the video, but it looks like his house might be haunted. Do you think this is the case, and do you believe in ghosts that can move things? Or what else could this have been? Snakes can be very unsettling and scary to most people, and when you encounter them in places you never expect them, it probably makes you even more scared. Of course, it all depends on the size of the snake, and the snake we're talking about is gigantic. Imagine you're standing on a platform waiting for the train, and a long black snake shows up. This is what happened on a subway platform in New York City, and, of course, all the people there were immediately horrified. However, one person was brave enough to film the snake on camera, and the man, as you can see, is standing super close to the snake. No details on whether the snake eventually left the platform on its own, or whether the workers did their job to remove the snake. This video is a collaboration between two YouTubers from Estonia. In this video, you can see what's happening from two different angles. The guys explored an abandoned building that served as a sauna until 1995. On the second floor, they find all kinds of equipment. When they get to the second floor, things start to get a little scary. At the end of the hallway, there's a door with the word ghosts on it. At first, they don't manage to enter the door, and in fact, it looks like someone's holding the door. Eventually, they kick in the door, and it turns out that there was a metal pole holding it back. As they walk in, they see a cloth hanging covering one of the rooms in the back. One of the boys decides to walk towards it, to which the other warns him that maybe he shouldn't do it. The boy doesn't listen and decides to take a look anyway, and then this happens. The boys run away with apparently something or someone running after them. After arriving back downstairs via the stairs, they run outside only to take off with their car. The following video was uploaded by a YouTube user named Rocky Mills. While he was in the process of fixing up an old house from the 1900s, he suddenly hears noises coming from the basement. He takes a look but finds nothing and decides to walk through the entire house because he has a feeling that there might be a burglar inside. At one point, a door opens and he walks towards it and this happens. Who is it? The man dropped everything on the floor and ran out of the house, and only came back later to pick up his phone. Since then, he's never come back, because he thinks there's an evil ghost haunting this house. 
Everyone has probably seen a moving wheelchair in a horror movie, but when you experience something like this in real life, it can really scare you. In fact, hospital staff in northern India were shocked when they saw a ghostly wheelchair moving on the security camera. But this wasn't the only time a wheelchair decided to move on its own. In this video, we see a wheelchair moving forward while no one is around. Here we see another wheelchair moving by itself in some facility. And in this video, a wheelchair also appears to be moving from within itself. Pretty creepy, right? Could these wheelchairs be controlled by ghosts? What do you think? Wreckful was a popular American Twitch streamer and esports player. He had a worldwide reputation for his skills and achievements in World of Warcraft. While live streaming at night in real life, he noticed that at one point he was being followed by a masked man. Wreckful turned the camera so that the fans who were watching his live stream could see what was happening. Everyone seemed to agree that he was being followed, but just to make sure, he turned around to see what the man was doing. Just as he took a relieved breath, he was shocked because the other man turned around as well. Wreckful then decided to run away, and we can see the man running after him. Fortunately, the man turned out to be a fan, but still, of course, this is pretty creepy, don't you think? Japan is one of the most densely populated countries per square meter, and no wonder it's impossible to get on the subway or on a train during rush hour. The train is the fastest and most convenient way to get around the city, which is why you can sometimes encounter serious problems getting on a train. The Cebu line in Tokyo is always crowded, and after watching this video, there's a small chance that you won't experience this again in your lifetime. You can see more people trying to get into the train than can actually get in, but the crowd keeps trying to get in. Eventually, the train staff filled the train with people by pushing the crowd inside. This YouTube channel belongs to a man named Frank, and he usually explores creepy old caves and abandoned mines in the United States. His YouTube channel has nothing to do with the paranormal, yet he has had a supernatural experience. When he was exploring the Horton Mine in Nevada, he says the atmosphere in the cave was a bit grim. At one point, when he looks further into the tunnel, he suddenly sees a large chain swinging back and forth. The chain would weigh about 45 pounds or 20 kilograms, so it couldn't have been the wind. When he saw this happen, he soon called it quits. When he returned to the cave a year later, he experiences another scary thing. What the fuck is that? This sound or voice was later identified by the YouTube comments as a woman with a French accent, who appears to be warning the man. The following video was submitted by a viewer to a Spanish YouTuber called Breakman. In the video, we see an elderly woman sitting on the couch while being filmed by probably one of her friends or relatives. A day before, someone had died in her house, and they all had a moment together to remember the person. However, if you look at the room in the background, we see something or someone looking behind the corner of the door. By the paranormal community, this is called a shadow figure. This would be a living presence of a spirit or entity. The person filming it didn't notice anything, but when they watched the video back later, no one in the family could explain what this had been. So it's thought that this might have been the deceased showing himself for the last time. If you've seen the movie It with the scary clown Pennywise, you probably remember that red balloon. But in real life, a similar balloon was captured on camera. But this balloon was chasing the staff at a children's hospital. No one has any idea how the balloon was able to move by itself to a certain direction. It also scared the hell out of all of the staff, as the balloon followed them all over the building. In addition to hovering inches above the floor, the balloon also had an unusual slow motion and was moving toward the person who was filming. When a paranormal expert inspected the footage, he assumed it was the spirit of a deceased person who had died in the hospital. But according to the expert, it would be nothing to worry about. It would just be a soul wandering through the hospital. Still very creepy, don't you think? What happened to the next streamer in Hollowtide remains a mystery. He's playing a game when all of a sudden, out of nowhere, he heard something. Just listen. Oh my god, that is pretty f Holy shit. It seemed like something or someone was making a knocking sound as he jumps out of his seat. He has no idea where it came from, and the people in the reactions heard the sound as well. Judging by his reaction, he was really frightened. When he asked his friends if they heard the sound too, they say no. But they suggest maybe it was a ghost. Could his house be haunted, or how else could this knocking be explained? If you heard a knocking sound at night while gaming, what would you do? I might move, because this is definitely really creepy. Are you afraid of ghosts? Yes? Then how about ghost trains? 
Believe it or not, but they exist, and one of them was even caught on camera on CCTV in China. At first, you don't really see anything, but then you see how the train enters the station. It stops for a while to pick up passengers and then leaves the station. This video footage was uploaded to YouTube, and viewers began discussing with each other, trying to guess what it could be and whether the video footage is fake or real. Some quickly assumed it was a ghost train, while others argued for a parallel universe that overlapped with ours. As always, there were many who think the video was fake and that we shouldn't believe everything we see online. What do you think? This video was uploaded by a user named Garments1. He's filming a graveyard, and at one point, he sees a face emerge from the corner of the building. When he saw this, he immediately ran towards it, but the ghost disappeared in a mysterious way and was nowhere to be seen. In my opinion, it doesn't look like the video was edited, but I could be wrong. Maybe it was a ghost. Unfortunately, there's little to no information about this video, so we can't do anything else but analyze the clip closely by what we see. The video appears to have been shot in August of 2015, and the camera hanging in the office is unfortunately not in color. Furthermore, no one seems to be present in the office, and the place looks deserted. Nevertheless, I decided to add this video to the list because what happens is, in my opinion, very creepy. In fact, if you look closely, out of nowhere you can see a small shadowy figure appearing from the left room and walking to the other side of the room. Despite the fact that the quality isn't good, it looks like some kind of ghost is walking there. Unfortunately, we have to decide for ourselves if this was therefore really a ghost sighting or not. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. La Planchada is a ghostly nurse who has allegedly been sighted in several hospitals in central Mexico and other areas nearby. The ghostly woman named Eulalia wears an old-fashioned nurse's uniform and was captured on camera at the Juarez Hospital in Mexico City. This woman used to work in this hospital, and she was known to always wear a clean and iron uniform, and all her patients loved her. One day, her beloved fiancé went missing, and she fell into a deep state of depression. When this happened, she herself became ill and eventually died in that same hospital. Shortly after her death, strange things began to happen in the hospital. The staff saw her spirit floating through the hallways, and she became a popular legend in Mexico. But what's even crazier is that the staff says she sometimes cared for the patients in the hospital's emergency room. Andy Milanakis is a former American actor who nowadays live streams on Twitch. While sitting at a table at a restaurant, a homeless man approaches him and offers him a lollipop. Andy may look like a teenager, but he's actually 45 years old. And he realizes that the man has bad intentions and wants to take him to his house. Andy then tries to run away. If you were to watch the live stream, you might really get goosebumps, especially when the man tells you that he just came from a mental institution. However, Andy remains calm, because there's plenty of other people around. But if this were to happen to you, the best thing to do is probably just run away as quickly as possible. Not all people like clowns, and if you see this creepy replica of the villain from Stephen King's It appearing at the train station at night, you will definitely be horrified. A person dressed in a creepy clown costume was spotted at the Dongan Hills train station in New York. A few people reported that the clown had been spotted in a few places at the train station, and photos of the clown were immediately posted on Twitter. Some people assumed that the clown was just part of a promotional campaign, and that there were no reasons to actually be afraid of him. Yet there was no official confirmation of this info, meaning it could, meaning it could have just been a madman in a clown costume. Some came to the conclusion that it was also better to stay away from the station to avoid becoming one of his victims. A boy named Nick has a Russian YouTube channel and usually uploads creepy abandoned places. In one of the videos, he goes with some friends to explore a large, narrow cave. Some sections are so narrow that he has to take off his backpack. While his friends walk ahead of him, he gets a little behind and is now on his own. At one point, he calls out to his friends, but gets no answer. Ребята! Ребят! Ребят! голоса. At this point, he realizes that he's been left alone. Despite being alone, he decides to continue crawling through the cave. In some places, there's even bats. As if this wasn't scary enough, strange things suddenly start happening. His camera suddenly starts acting strange, and a little later, when he tries to climb further up, it seems as if something or someone is throwing rocks down. <laughs> A minute or two later, his light goes on and off, and he suddenly hears strange noises in the cave. Ah! 
Now he starts to find it a little creepy and decides to go back to where he came from. When he gets to his backpack, he sees that his stuff has been snooped through. As he's checking his backpack, he notices in the background that there's two eyes watching him. Nick claims he didn't notice that at the time, but only later when he was home and looking back at the footage. I wonder what it could have been. The following video comes from the Instagram account of a woman named Cassie Smith. She was on vacation with her boyfriend to Oahu, an island in Hawaii, and she encountered something there that still terrifies her to this day. If you look closely, you can see something on the right side of the photo. When the photo is zoomed in, we see a creepy figure that appears to be covered in mud. Cassie initially sent her vacation photos to her mother, and her mother noticed the creepy figure and asked who it was. Cassie says that there was no one else in the rainforest and that there were no statues at all. After doing some research, this could possibly have been the spirit of a dead person. After doing some research, this could possibly have been the spirit of a dead Hawaiian warrior, also called a night marcher. In some places on the island, the figure was said to have been sighted and has since become an urban legend. Mortuaries are probably one of the creepiest places you can be in, but it's sometimes said that you don't have to be afraid of dead people. However, what happened in this Russian mortuary was pretty terrifying. On the security camera, we see a man waking up after being declared dead. When this video went viral, many people were shocked. They assumed that he was declared dead by mistake, and this phenomenon is also called catalepsy. Some people claim that this video footage could never have been real, and that the man had probably had some drinks with friends the night before and just passed out. It's hard to say if this is real or not. What do you think? Popular footballer Neymar loves to stream on Twitch in front of many fans in his spare time. In this video, he plays a horror game during Halloween with some friends. Neymar is surrounded by Halloween decorations, and someone told him to take a look over his shoulder. We see someone standing behind Neymar with a monster-like mask, and it scared the footballer to death. The 28-year-old footballer seemed to be genuinely scared. However, the masked man burst out laughing, along with the rest of Twitch, and revealed that it was just a joke. The man behind the mask was his good friend, Gil Cabola. How would you react if your friend scared you like that? Let me know in the comments. The Zanetti train is one of the most famous ghost trains in the world. The train disappeared in 1911 with 104 passengers on board, and it's not been seen since. However, this mystery has never been solved, and to this day, we don't know its whereabouts. The passengers on this train were all upper-class people, and it's supposed to travel and enjoy the beautiful grandeur of nature in the Lombardi Mountains. As the train entered the Lombardi Tunnel, which at the time was one of the longest tunnels in the world, it suddenly disappeared. An investigation was launched shortly after this incident, but it never yielded any results. The train simply disappeared mysteriously as it entered the tunnel, and that's all humanity knows to this day. There's still no explanation of what happened in the tunnel, but some witnesses saw black smoke as the train just entered the tunnel. Do you have any idea what happened? Could the train have just driven into a portal to another place in the universe? What do you think? In this video, we see a large Great Dane walking around the kitchen. At one point, a light source seems to fly by. This does not go unnoticed. The dog is even a little surprised by it, and he doesn't know what he just saw. The dog ends up trying to search for the mysterious thing throughout the house, but this is not the only thing that happens in this video. About a minute later, a car drives by with bright headlights. If you look closely, you can see a shadowy figure walking from left to right. Whether you believe in supernatural events or not, the shadowy figure combined with the dog's behavior is quite creepy. In this video, we see some engineers who had to measure some old Japanese tunnels from the Second World War for radiation levels. Because these tunnels are 500 feet or 150 meters deep in the ground and are potentially radioactive, it's therefore off limits to the public. In the past, the tunnels were also used for mining purposes. When the men walk through one of the tunnels, not only does their camera start to go crazy, but something else is recorded that startled them. Although opinions differ on this, some think this was a ghost sighting of an old Japanese soldier. According to the uploader of the video, very small amounts of radioactive radiation were detected, which would be just enough to raise the spirits of soldiers from the distant past. Although the story sounds credible, I don't know if this is a real ghost sighting. What do you think? The next video from 2014 comes from a security camera somewhere in a hospital or a mortuary in India. As we can see, there are a number of people lying on the floor, but what they managed to capture on camera here is pretty terrifying. At one point, a blackish creature flies by. If we're to believe the uploader of the video, the ghostly figure came from a morgue. Do you believe that lost souls linger in the places where they left their bodies? Or what do you think happens to your soul after you die? It sounds logical that paranormal events are observed in hospitals and morgues, but whether this video is real, I have no idea. 
I'll leave it up to you to decide. One of the creepiest livestream moments of all time belongs to Conman167. In this video, the streamer claims to have captured a ghost on camera. Looking at the video footage, do you believe this to be the case? If you keep your eyes on the left side of the screen, you'll see something moving. I don't know if this is a ghost, but how else could this be explained? If we slow down the video, you can see that there's some kind of web or hair lock of a ghost. What do you think? Could this be paranormal things happening in this house, or what else could it be? The next video footage is terrifying, as it shows a severe earthquake in Mexico City. It was the Puebla earthquake that occurred in 2017, with an estimated magnitude of 7.1. The earthquake had a strong shaking for up to 20 seconds. Even though 20 seconds doesn't seem like much, it greatly frightened the people who arrived on this train. A mass of people began rushing towards the exit. Some people started pushing each other, which made the situation worse because everyone panicked. No wonder people were panicking because the earthquake was so strong that the train just shook like a toy. As the video footage went viral online, some viewers began discussing whether it was safer to stay on the train or just run away. What do you think? A YouTuber named Franco TV explores a creepy crypt, an underground space in a church building in eastern Florida. The church is called the Church of Peace, and he decided to explore this place all by himself with a camera. As he walked back and forth, he got the feeling that he was being watched. In fact, he thinks that he had seen a shadow and even heard footsteps. When he walks to the inner part of the crypt, he sees a shadowy figure in the reflection of the door. That is He runs towards it, but finds nothing. A moment later, he listens to a spirit box where he just picked up something that says someone's name. Do you know my name? Frank. Frank. <laughs> because he thinks it's all getting pretty creepy now, he decides to pack his stuff up and go home. At one point, he hears something else, and what happens next is pretty scary. Take a look. Hello? I just... Okay, stop, stop, stop. Stop. The following video comes from a ghost hunter named Phil Koch, and he decides to investigate the Alchemist Theater in Milwaukee, Wisconsin on his own. According to stories, this is said to be one of the spookiest places in the city. When he walks into the theater, he decides to sit down on one of the seats and leaves the camera rolling in hopes of capturing something. For a long time, nothing happens, but then finally something happens. Just watch. What the hell? Something just moved. Something just moved behind me. As you saw, the chair behind him folded open. But this wasn't the scariest thing that happened, because a moment later, he's walking around the building and he hears footsteps above him. At first, he thought that people were working upstairs, but later he found out that this was not the case. When he wants to check one of the rooms, this happens. Again. And then we'll take a look. Oh. It's still back here again. And then we'll take a look. Oh. Hello? Hey. But this is not the only thing, because it gets even scarier. After this happens, he runs out as fast as he can, and from what I understand, he hasn't returned since. Here we see a Russian patient who would have been one of the participants of the Russian sleep experiment. The Russian sleep experiment was a scientific experiment conducted by the USSR in the 1940s. The idea was to keep participants from sleeping for about 30 days. It was revealed that the researchers took political prisoners and locked them in a gas chamber for 15 days. The reason for this is because they had to keep the subjects awake. It seems that the person in the video may be one of those political prisoners of this experiment. Pretty disturbing. Because in the video footage, we see a skinny person who looks starved. At one point, he sits down on the floor next to the hospital bed and looks completely lost. However, some people in the comments say that this video footage cannot be real. On July 5th, 2019, a streamer named Shinova was singing while playing the piano, when her singing was suddenly interrupted by a violent shaking in her room. Her guitar and other streaming equipment began to shake, and everyone in the chat thought there was an earthquake. 
It later became clear that it was an earthquake, with a magnitude of 7.1. Although California where she lives is mostly used to earthquakes because they're so common, that doesn't make any object in your room that vibrates violently less terrifying. Nova therefore quickly runs out of the room. The viewers of her stream watch her leave without turning off the stream, but after a few seconds, the shaking thankfully stops, and she was perfectly okay. Well, if you thought the rush hour in Japan was intense, here's a look at what happens in China. This is a subway in Beijing, and it's only 1 p.m., but as you can see, the station is already super crowded, and when the train stops, the craziness begins. It seems that the crowd waiting outside didn't even give the people on the train a chance to get off. For most people, standing among such a large crowd to enter a train would be quite annoying. If you're not careful, you could also fall or get trampled by the mass of people. But it seems that people in China know how to behave in crowded places. Still, it remains pretty hard to believe, don't you agree? Some kids were filming themselves stacking cups. The video was uploaded in October of 2011, and the description says that they have no idea how this event of a ghostly doll could have happened. And since they had just stored the doll in the barn, if you look closely, you can see that the doll behind the children slowly rises. Another thing I noticed about this video is that at this one point, there also seems to be some sort of ball of light going into the doll. The video looks pretty authentic to me, in my opinion. I've heard stories about possessed dolls before, but it can also be fake. It's up to you to decide. If you watch the scary videos on this channel, then you know I've talked about Gettysburg before. It was here that the greatest battle of all time of the American Civil War took place. According to many people, this place is teeming with ghosts. However, there's a video that's said to be one of the most credible ghost sightings ever. The following video was shot in November of 2001, and a family on vacation saw something moving in the woods opposite of them. Now, it's pretty hard to see, but some experts from the dark zone have stabilized the footage, and you can see several figures marching back and forth. What makes this video very believable, in my opinion, are the reactions of the family, and especially their child, who asks who those people are. Look! Look! Isn't it those people? Can't be. There's no Not up in the trees! This would be impossible, according to the family and the experts, because the figures also seem to be marching high up in the tree. In this video, we see a man filming a corridor in an unknown hospital somewhere in Honduras. It's hard to explain exactly what we're seeing here, but it appears to be a creature or ghost looking around the corner of one of the rooms. After seeing the video footage, many people assumed it was a ghost, but if so, it's a very unusual ghost, as it seems to have a strange transparent color. Other people in the comments thought it might be an alien because it had an egg-shaped head. There was also speculation that strange experiments were going on at this hospital. What I personally wonder is why the people were consciously looking around a corner of the room. Probably they don't want to be noticed. Unfortunately, we can't find any more info about this video, so I'll leave it to you whether you think it's real. Ninja is of course one of the most popular streamers because of his great success with the game Fortnite. But did you know that one time he experienced something creepy in his house? He shared his story on the H3 podcast. One night when his wife wasn't home, he went to bed early. However, his dog started acting strange and became extra sensitive to something. He had turned off the equipment, but according to him, out of nowhere, they turned back on. He was apparently so scared that he took out his katana. Also, one of his viewers saw something strange while Ninja was live streaming. It's hard to see, but in the upper left corner, there seems to be some kind of shadow moving. What could this be? Is his house haunted? What do you think? Not many people believe in the paranormal, but when you see it with your own eyes, you want to show it to other people. This situation occurred in Mexico City on the underground train, and it was like a scene from a movie. The video footage shows a man dressed in a suit and a woman screaming like crazy. It appears that the man is performing an exorcism, and people on the crowded train are shocked to see it. This video was posted on Facebook and was viewed more than a million times. The video then shows the man in suit praying for the woman, who keeps screaming, and we can assume she would be possessed. The man says in the name of Jesus, go away, you have to leave. The scene gets crazier and crazier. We can't say for sure whether it was set up or not, but bizarre it certainly was. In this video, we see a woman named Laura Lucas, who had gone out for a night and when she came home tired, fell asleep on her couch. At some point, another creepy woman walks into the house and checks to see if Laura is actually asleep. At this point, she snoops around the house while grabbing some money, jewelry, and an expensive watch. 
If you're seeing this for the first time, you probably think that this event is from the movie, but it's not. In fact, this really happened. Moments later, Laura's little dog comes to greet the mysterious woman just before she grabs the car keys and runs off. The next morning, Laura checked her security camera and discovered that the entire incident was caught on camera. This is pretty creepy in my opinion. I hate to think of someone just walking into your house when you're just sleeping. The following video is said to have first appeared on Mexican television sometime in 2005. Unfortunately, I couldn't find much info about it, but we see a television host who's looking for something or someone at a cemetery in the middle of the night. After a while, he hears something that looks like a little girl crying. The television host looks to see where the sound's coming from and suddenly sees something sitting by a gravestone. The man decides to shout something and then this happens. Amiga. Niña. Ay, no According to stories circulating on the internet, the television host is said to still have nightmares of what happened that night. We've already shown you some creepy videos of wheelchairs moving and red balloons chasing hospital staff, but after watching this video footage from a hospital in Argentina, you can almost be sure that ghosts really do haunt hospitals. The video was taken by the hospital's security camera, and at the beginning, you see a bed moving from side to side, which is certainly not caused by the wind. In fact, the bed moves by itself and eventually falls over, which is hard to explain. However, if you're a skeptical person, you probably think it was the wind. But if you look closely at the plants, they don't move. Only the bed. And this was not the first time paranormal things were recorded at this hospital. When a man walked out to throw away the trash, he saw that another bed was moving on its own. Very creepy. And you can't blame the man for running off quickly. The next girl named Miss Kitty is walking around her town while streaming for several hundreds of people. At one point, she comes across a man on the street who asks if she can sing a song for her. She allows this, but after she says goodbye again, the man decides to walk behind her. She stops walking and asks him why he's doing this, to which he explains that he felt he just had to follow her. He also asks strange questions, including how old she is. She decides to run away, but the man chases after her in broad daylight. She eventually runs into the store and tells them that she's being followed by an old man and asks if she can stay there for a while. However, the man didn't go inside, so I assume this event probably has a happy ending. A very sad statistic says that the number of people being pushed in front of trains increases every year. The next video footage was shown in the news and includes a moment where we see a woman walking toward a train. We can't show what happens next, but fortunately, this woman survived the terrifying moment. But sometimes things go wrong too. There are often multiple cameras in train stations, so the perpetrators won't get away with it so easily. In this case, the suspect was also immediately apprehended, and the woman was attended to by ambulance personnel. The following video was filmed by security cameras in a hotel in Illinois in the United States. Hotel employees heard screaming coming from a hotel room, and they decided to send someone there. When John arrived at the hotel room, he received information from another hotel employee through an earpiece. John relates that he does indeed hear screaming. What's going on, John? The strange thing about this is that no one had at all checked into his room. The hotel employee tells John that he'd better wait until the police arrive, but John decides to take a look anyway. If you look closely, at this moment, you'll see a ghostly figure leaving the room. Pretty creepy if you ask me. John comes out a little later and tells us that there was no one in the hotel room at all, but that everything had been turned upside down and that the shower was on. Nobody's in there. Man, that's, that's scary. What we see on this security camera is that a spirit appears to be coming out of someone's body. It probably can't get creepier than this. It's unclear which country or hospital this video footage was taken, but the video is from 2014 and it appears to show a person lying on a hospital bed. And what happens next is probably proof that a soul can actually leave the body. As we can see, a spirit entity seems to come out of the body. Some people say that this was the person's own soul. Could this really be possible? Of course, there were many people skeptical about the video footage, but there are many people in the comments who believe that this is real. The following event is among the scariest moments ever captured on livestream. Rub Z, as the streamers called, was gaming, when suddenly the door behind him slowly opened and then slammed shut. But this was not the only thing that happened, because suddenly the lights went on in the hallway. He decides to walk over to turn the lights off again, but right after that, the light comes back on. 
Rubsy tells the viewers that his house belongs to a friend of his. Finally, another scary thing happens. As a box sitting on the table behind him flies off. If I was babysitting at another house and it turns out the house is haunted, I probably would have left a long time ago. We've talked before about the spookiest train in the world, but now we're going to show you the spookiest train station in the world. Indeed, the scariest place to travel by train is Big Uncoder train station, located in India. The station has been in ruins for more than 50 years and was reopened in 2009. But it wasn't long before that it was closed again. But what was the reason behind it? According to myth, a mysterious spirit woman in a white dress walks along the tracks of the train station. According to the story, it could be the spirit of Lachan Kumari, a queen of the Santo tribe who donated much of her land to the railroads to help her people survive. The YouTuber named Abandoned Mines and Unusual Places is known for exploring unusual places like caves, mines, and tunnels. After reviewing a new flashlight, he goes into a 150-year-old abandoned cave all by himself with some equipment. At one point, he hears a strange sound coming from the place he had just passed. He suspects it might be the wind or maybe birds or snakes and decides to walk back a bit. Here he hears the sound again. Well, I don't know what that is. That doesn't sound like wind, but that's crazy. Finally, he leaves the cave and uploads his events to YouTube. Let me know in the comments what you think the sound could have been. The house of the Watts family, in my opinion, is one of the most believable ghost sightings I've ever seen. The reason for this is because the video footage comes directly from a body cam from one of the agents. In the house, Shanann Watts lived with Chris Watts and their two children. Because of Chris's actions, Shanann and her two daughters, Bella and Cece, are no longer among us. The story is too grim to tell you on YouTube, so if you want to know what happened, you better look it up yourself. In the following video, we see two agents from the canine unit entering Chris's house to investigate their disappearance. As soon as they're inside, we immediately see something transparent appear on the left side of the stairs walking down the stairs. The home investigation took about two hours, and in several instances, voices are captured on the body cam. Just listen. But at one point, when they want to investigate the closet, one of the agents hears a voice of a child giggling. Yes. The woman is so confused that she lets the other agent figure it out, who also heard the sound. But they couldn't find where it was coming from. I heard it. I definitely heard the same thing you did. Yeah, and then he just sort of After the house was searched and the man was taken away, there were also reports of neighbors seeing an appearance of a woman walking around the house a day later. So could this be proof that the ghost world really exists? What do you think? Let me know in the comments. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos we've made, click one on the screen or take a look at the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.